And what a beautiful night's sleep that was. It was really quiet round here. Just how I prefer it. There was no camper van doors slamming. No one talking till one o'clock in the morning. So now, I'm gonna head into Bayeux and I'm gonna do some sightseeing. I'm also going to meet my friend, Darren, and we're going to ride around the coast, and we're going to see a few bits and pieces. Gosh, what a beautiful, what an absolutely beautiful part of the world Normandy is. I'm absolutely falling in love with the place, it's wonderful. I mean, I know that places always look a, bit, a, little, a little bit different in in winter when all the trees have lost their leaves but it's so green and so lush and it very much a lot of this reminds me a little bit of of Devon more than anything else and the colour of the green reminds me of Devon because I know when you go to Devon it is very very green but, uh, an absolutely beautiful part of the world. So, I'm about seven miles southwest of Bayeux, and it's only going to take me, uh, how long is it going to take me? It's going to take me about 15 minutes to get into Bayeux probably about 10 minutes really because one of the most surprising things around, around here is the roads there's very few people on the roads it's very very uncluttered I mean the country roads are superb you see very few cars on the country roads and once you get on the main roads they're not very busy at all. One thing I do need to do today is go to a supermarket because I'm running out of muesli I need some milk and I want some bread as well. I bought some bread yesterday and it was absolutely delightful. The bread in France is beautiful. Bread, the French make the best bread in the world. It is wonderful. Oh, I had some bread a few nights ago and it had hazelnuts and cherries inside it. It was divine. In fact, was it hazelnuts and cherries or was it some sort of berries? Uh, it was beautiful. It was supposed to last me a day. <laughs> and I, I ate it all in an evening. Uh, I was going to have half, the, half of the loaf in the evening and half the loaf the next evening, but I ate it all in an evening. The bread here is delightful. The best bread in the world. I am really falling in love with this place. It's wonderful. So, what else am I going to do today? Well, hopefully, well, we may have lunch somewhere and uh, we'll just see what's available. Considering the amount of British cars that were on the ferry coming across, I've seen very few British cars, to be honest. I've seen maybe two. Maybe they all go deeper into France, I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to make a few miles up and I'm going to meet my friend, Darren. And then we're going to do some sightseeing, so I'll speak to you soon.
I'm all right. Oh. A few moments later. Back at Utah Beach again, but this time I'm going to go into the museum this time because when I was here yesterday I just walked around But today I'm going to go into the museum surrounded by triumphs
Hello the internet and hello to my subscriber. You're looking exceptionally well. I've not seen you for a while, but here I am. I'm still in France. And before I go on, I want to say hello to Ian and Eddie back home in Helensburgh and Dumbarton. Hello, lads. And here I am. Um, I've had a few days in Bayeux and we've done a few miles. Uh, my two friends, they left this morning. They've caught an early morning ferry back to the UK. And I was due to leave today as well, but I really fancied uh, to stay here another day for two things, to catch up on some video editing, but also just to enjoy this peace and this quiet, this tranquility and this lush greenery that is rural France. It is beautiful. I've really fallen in love with uh, with Normandy. It really is special. I mean, I fall in love with every place that I visit. I always I fall in love with every everywhere I visit. I always fall in love with it. I think it's superb because when you go to new places, it's different from where you live and where you grow up and what you're used to. But um, but I love travelling. I love seeing new countries. And this is the first time for me over in Normandy, and it really is beautiful. I've fallen in love with the place. If we had the money, I think I'd like to live here, to be honest. 
but the roads are great every the pace of life is slow everyone drives nice and slow um the food is great the bread is superb uh, i've had so much bread since i've been here and everyone is so friendly and so nice uh, bonjour bonjour it, it really is nice and uh I feel at home here somehow. Well, mind you, I could be part Norman. I don't know, going back on my ancestry. Maybe I've come home or maybe, uh, but there we go. So, my friends have gone back. Past few days, we've done quite a few miles. We've been north up the coast, been south down the coast. We've been inland. We've seen lots of things. We've seen lots of museums. And we've enjoyed all sorts of food. Also, yesterday was the, the climax for me, really, because we visited, visited Bayeux. What a beautiful, beautiful town. And I saw the Bayeux Tapestry, and I saw the Bayeux Cathedral, which is magnificent. And considering it was built, they started to build it in the late 1200s. It's just superb. But the Bayeux Tapestry, again, it's something I've always wanted to see. And I was mesmerized, absolutely mesmerized to see history there in front of your eyes. I just love history. Um, so that's another, another tick off my, uh, another tick off the box. So, that's me. I've had a lovely quiet day, enjoying this beautiful sunshine. Past few days have been brilliant. Yesterday was about 24, 25 degrees. The day before, it started at 30, we went up to 32, then we ended at 34. It was a beautifully hot day. But today is probably about the same again in terms of um, about 22, 23 degrees. It's beautiful. I love this. I love this climate. So I'm going to have another pleasant night. I'm going to cook some chili con carne shortly and some pasta. And then tomorrow I'm going to pack up. I'm going to be heading towards. Uh, I'm going to be heading northeast. Head towards the the Belgian border, and I may slip into Luxembourg. I want to go to Luxembourg actually because that's another city of I, I do want to visit. But north of Luxembourg, there's a big castle I want to go and see as well. So once I've done the Ardennes and once I've visited Luxembourg, and then that's when I'm going to pop over to Germany and head over towards Frankfurt. So this is me in Bella France. It's not Bella France, that's Bella Italy. I just love this part of France. It's beautiful. And I'm definitely coming back to this place again. I'm definitely coming back to Normandy. I'm definitely coming back to France. But tomorrow I'll be heading northeast uh, to New horizons, new adventures. So, I will speak to you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye for now.